Hello everybody and welcome to this new episode of our project uh, Restaurant Management System using Laravel. So in the in this video we are going to add the servants or the waiters uh, functionality. So let's go ahead and add a new folder here. We call him servants. We add as always the index. creates and edits a page so we add so as we have here so we add creates and uh, what else the edits so let's move let's copy the last one that we have here so I think where is the tables the index tables so let's look for the index of the tables because we will have the same thing as we have done inside tables so no need to to write all the page again so we just change so we can name it waiters or anything here we give it users or you can use anything here we have servants creates for the routes here uh, we have the name and address address <coughs> And what is I think that's that's all we have only the name and uh, address so that's all that's all so here we look through all the servants or the waiters we have ID name and for the address we check if we have the address we display the address we display the address here so we use servants address if we don't have uh, so here if we will check for as I said we will check for the address if we have the address we will display it here if no we will display that icon and let's move so here we add the routes that take us to the edits page so we here we use the id because we don't have a slug we also here use the id to to update and to remove and let's add the destroy route so let's check and see what we have here so we have the servants undefined variable table on line 53 where is the table we don't have a table here ah, it's here so this is the table and let's also check for the pagination which is tables so we change it to servants so let's check and see what we have so now we have the all the waiters they are here and beside we have the links to the, uh, the buttons to update and to remove the waiter so let's add let's add a new one for uh, for adding a new one we will copy just create page from the table and let's paste it here here we have the sidebar so we will add sidebar soon here add new waiter here servant uh, here servants servant store for the routes and as I said we have the name and we have the address so the address is not required so here we use the address and here we use the address and here the value is the address so let's see let's move down 
so here we have the select box build box so we don't need a select box so what what is so let's check and see what we have inside this page <coughs> there we have add a new waiter let's uh, add someone and click submit arguments I think that's I forgot to remove the I have the same error so check other uh, so check the other controllers so I have the same uh, same error I think that's it's servants or uh, servants controller this one so check for the requests in validation so I have as I have uh, as we have seen in the last episodes, we have here this problem that I didn't see, this typo. So I used here the requests. Here, requests, so this. So let's check, see if the new waiter is add or no. So let's move now. So here we have the second page. If we go to the second page, we have the waiter is here. So let's go back to the first one. So now let's add the update page. Let's remove these ones for the table. Table and here. So here we have the add new waiter and here we add updates and we give name for the servants name here servants updates and we send the servants id here we have the for the value so we give it servants name also for the address if there is already an address if not it will be blank and uh, don't forget to add the method the method which will be put so let's see what we have here so if i update uh, if i refresh the page let's let's update the first one so we have here the doctor francisca so let's rename it to something else jack sparrow and here uh, 14 streets I uh, don't know New York submits so as you can see it is updated if I remove the third one let's remove this one Kenya Nicolas so it is it has been removed so this is the this is the update functionality let's just add think that we need to add uh, here uh, inside the index where is the index page this one so here between this uh, these two ones let's give it margin rights of one just to have space between these two buttons because I think that they are called to each other so just to separate to have uh, space between them so now it's more elegant so let's move let me see what we have here so let's add i think before we move to the menus let's add the sidebar the sidebar will make us uh, make us move smoothly throughout our application so uh, we don't need uh, all the time every in every moment to go by uh, to use the URL to move so let's add this sidebar so I'm going to the so let's close all the files so we finish it with this ones let's go to the sidebar uh, to the layouts folder and we add sidebar and blade so here we will have a list group we add list group 
with the margin bottom of 3 and here uh, inside this one we will have links that we will take list group item and list group item action classes and here so I will bring this one just to see classes that we have added so here the first one it will take us to the route which is the category which is the category index and here uh, we will add a font item of font awesome of uh, th list so we will have this so we have already add this ones so here we have the categories so let's add a new one next will be for the menu it will take us to the menu and here we add menu and we give it icon of clipboard clipboard and list so let's move to the next one next one will be for the tables tables index so here we have the, the, the icon which is the chair icon and here the menu we change it to tables so let's move to the next one for the next one it will take us to the servants index and here we have the users cog and here we have the waiters waiters so let's so this is our this is our uh, this is our uh, sidebar let's add a link to take us back to the home page if we want to go to the home page i'm going to add row with a call of md of of uh, of 12 of 12 with a margin bottom of 3 so this one and let's add a link as i have said link it will be beta n beta n beta n outline outline uh, secondary secondary and let's here it will take us to the routes as we have said to the route which is the home which is the home and here we have class inside this one we will have uh, we'll have uh, font awesome which will take us to a chevron or uh, we use a row left to go back to the home page so let's include this this uh, let's include this sidebar inside all the files that we have done so here we have include uh, layouts sidebar layouts 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 sidebar I don't know what happened to my <laughs> to my uh, hands. I don't know why I have all these type of errors. Maybe because I'm typing so fast. So this is the sidebar and index. We have here the sidebar. Also for the servants. Let's move to the servants. So here we have the sidebar also here inside the edit page of the servants we have the sidebar and inside the index page we have also the sidebar and the tables inside the tables we have the sidebar and edit page we have sidebar and last one is the index page we have sidebar 
so let's see what we have here so i will refresh the page and see what we have so as you can see we have this back to take us to the home page and here we have all the menus if we click on categories we are redirected to the categories the menus so we don't have a menus index yet that's why we got this error we have the tables take us to the tables and we have the waiters which take us to the waiters so let's add s here inside the index page here so here we have just a single waiter so here let's add s so refresh the page and see what we have here before we move to the next to the next uh, episode where we are going to add to display the menus and add also the menus so we have here the waiters so let's move to the next episode where we are going to to display add edit and delete menus so stay tuned so uh, if this is the first time that you are watching this channel don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next episode.